Hello everyone, welcome back to Tanja's World. Y'all, we're here for the quick one too. Y'all, I did some pancakes real quick, some turkey bacon, scrum, I mean fried egg, turkey bacon and pancakes and what? Pinta butter. Yeah, it's hunting. How y'all doing? Welcome back. Y'all, ooh, let me get right. Let's get right. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> How y'all doing? <laughs> Let's talk about social media a little bit. <laughs> Not laughing, but in my head. These little couples, right? Y'all know what's in this cup. I'd like, you know. I think one of them named Juan and Rissa, right? That's one couple I'm going to talk about. And the other couple, I forget what they name is because I really don't keep up with them like that, but they just happen to they keep coming across my feed, right? Big old Lama Jack. White guy, she married to a black little girl. She didn't cut all her hair off now. And her storyline was that she had a couple kids before. Now, this is what she put out. I don't even know her name. But she supposed to had a couple kids before she met him. Some pure black kids before she met him, right? She married him. Wind up having two kids by him. So, she was putting out this scenario like he, you know, like when he, when she met him, he came in and, and upgraded her and what, okay, beautiful, fine, whatever. I never really took to it. Because for me, I don't know if it's just acting or she seemed like a little bipolar. She's like. And ain't nothing wrong with being bipolar. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is she always seems like she's over the edge, right? She, she's too hyper for me. But anyway, um, she put her business out like he 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 did this, he did that, and he was up. And so now. They must have got into it about some. I don't know. And supposed to have went live saying about she was the reason why they live the lifestyle that they live and this and that and whatever, whatever. Now, me personally, it can be true. It can't be true. It could be just for ratings. Because, honey, you can't put nothing past these people nowadays, honey. It's, all, it's, it's show business, right? But let's just say it's true. A couple weeks ago, she uprooted everybody because she wanted to move, just say, I don't know, to Hawaii somewhere. I don't know. 
when she was trying to put on a skit like she didn't know whether or not he was coming back or whatever. But I think she was sincere. She didn't know whether or not that joker was coming back or not. Hmm? Me personally, I'm a picture person. I like to look at pictures and draw my own conclusions, right? I do body language and stuff, right? Me personally, <laughs> I think the TikTok likes. And, and YouTube and whatever is okay. But you can't force your lifestyle on somebody else. That's what I'm getting. And I think the man is tired. Look like to me. Sometimes. You want to come home and just be normal. Right? That's the energy I pick up from that. But she leaked this tape about she was the one doing this and she bought the car and, the, and I mean the range wrong the range rover and she put the down payment on the house. Boo boo boo. If you doing everything, what you leaving for him to do? Oh, okay. Just because you can do it, that don't mean you should do it. Hmm. You gotta let a man be a man. Let him figure it out. Mm -hmm. If all he can afford is an apartment, that's where we living at. Mm -hmm. Until times get better. Mm -mm. You have to be willing to humble yourself and love your man where he at. Mm -hmm. Come on, somebody. I promise you, if I gave me a good one, we can live in an apartment. I don't care. Because this, this is just materialistic stuff. We're going to leave it behind anyway. As long as I'm happy. Mm, okay. I'm over here minding my business. Okay. But check this out. They put that on live for everybody to see. Whatever, however. Let's go on to this other little couple. Warren and Rissa. She was a cute little girl. Like, like she mixed with something. Mm -hmm. She could be mixed with half black and half something. She could be just Hispanic. I'm not sure. But, but he 100% black little boy. Mm -hmm. The last couple I was talking about. He, he white and she black. Just best in case anybody wanted to know. But check this out. There's one and Marissa, Rissa, whatever her name is. Y'all go look them up. They all over the internet. But anywho, but I, I really don't care enough to keep up with them like that. But I'm just, we just, we just chatting and eating breakfast. <laughs> yeah. Check this out. She probably been brought this man on live. To tell him that she didn't have a fling a long time ago, though. <laughs> These young girls are silly. Hmm? And why I say that? Some things just between you and Jesus. Hmm? I 
And I'm not condoning if she cheated on him because she wrong for that. He seemed, he seemed to be a decent little guy. But in my honest opinion, I don't believe the mess is true. Why I say that? I don't know no ninja alive. Gonna come back on camera the very next day, seem like. Boy, bye. The acting ain't that well to me. You come on with that with a sad looking face while she over there sitting up there talking, making plans for the heat. Yeah, get off my camera. Get off my face. I, 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 I want to block them. Oh, I'll figure out how to do it. It's ratings to me. I don't believe it. I just don't. Mm-hmm. I don't believe it. Like I said, they still making money. And I'm like, if, if this the best idea y'all can come up with, I, shame on them messing with people's feelings because some people are, gener uh, are gen generally concerned about them. I'm not, though, because I think it's fake. You want to tell him something that personal? That should have been done in person. In personal. Why would you come online and do that, and to 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 even embarrass him like that? If it's someone that you love, I'm like, okay, now you can confess to him if you feel like uh, messing with your little conscience or whatever, whatever. But you don't bring him on national TV to tell him that. Like, come on now. To me, that ain't love. That's something else. That's acting to me. Hmm. Baby. Baby, like, baby, like I said, honey, that would have been between me and Jesus. Hmm. What a need to hurt him. No, oh, okay. You want to clear your conscience or whatever, but no man dot com. I ain't with it, but I think it's fake. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it's fake. I really do. And if it is, shame on them. And if it's real, shame on her from bringing him on television and embarrassing him like that. That's my opinion about it. Real time. Real talk in real time. Mm -mm. I'm going to have cheese. We're down there in Tennessee, check them out. I got a mosquito in here. The honey is good. Mm -hmm. Dayton, Tennessee. Good honey. My baby sent me that um, wild back cake confessions. If you don't know who that is, go check her out. Run a playlist. Get her watch hours up. Mm -hmm. I tell you. I need to go post something, but I promise y'all. Um, I did a pookie yesterday. I didn't go to work. 
Because y'all always in pain. But today, I'm better. Because where are you? Old school. Some salt water and some peroxide in my mouth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, some might say, but next time. I won't be leaving without some pain medication. Mm -hmm. I'm so thankful I had some left over from my surgery. Sir, no, I'm take an Advil. Uh, no, no. The, the the screw the screws, baby. That ain't no Advil type of medicine. You need some Tramadol or something like that. Quit playing with me. Mm -hmm. And that's what I have. And y'all, you know, you might have had two pain, but you know, how you fall asleep, the pain was like, even when I try to fall asleep, y'all, the pain would wake me back up. Oh, okay. I was like that a good 48 hours. I was praying to God. I ain't overdosed myself. Honey, I've taken Advil, Tramadol. I took a hydrocodone or whatever that was I had. A Lee. I was on everything. My mouth was hurting me. But I was doing it within like four to six hours, though, y'all. Let me just say that. I ain't crazy. Mm hmm. But I was around the clock taking something. No way. And then in the morning, I had to try to get myself ready for work that night. I tried to get up and don't take anything. I felt like my face was on doom, 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 doom. I said, oh no. I called her early in the a.m. I ain't coming. Took me some pills and went back to bed. Mm -mm. I love me. Mm -mm. Took me some more medication and went back to bed, baby. But somebody say, but next time. They're going to do me right. And it's crazy because why? I wasn't necessarily in pain at the doctor's office. I mean, at, at the dentist's office. I wasn't. I don't know if it was because of my adrenaline or what. But somebody said by the time I got home, a good hour. It was a wrap. Mm -hmm. It was a wrap, y'all. Yeah, it was. Well, anyway, I finished my food like a good little girl. Okay? I ain't want that. <laughs> I ain't want that at all. And come on here and tell y'all, hey, okay? And if you know what's in this cup, put it down in the chat. Because y'all know what's in the cup. Quit acting like you don't know. Mmm. Woohoo! Y'all, thank you and thank you and thank you again for always coming back to see about you, girl. I appreciate y'all taking our time of your day or night. Mm -hmm. I really do. Because what? Everybody's time is valuable, right? And I appreciate y'all. 
I love y'all to the moon and back, like in real time, right? Y'all, if you're on the highway, excuse me, be careful back and forth, right? Love yourself and always love on someone else, and I'm going to see y'all next time. Bye.